Hello and welcome to Beam NG Drive. I'm David in Arc. Today we are on the train testing map from Spencer Johnson. All right. This is actually going to be just a little experiment. I want to see what happens if we leave the rear wheels on a vehicle, but we swap out the front for the Bligio train track wheels. Oh, yeah, 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 yeah. Oh, 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 oh. okay, we, we, we jumped the track. Whoops, so it, it's okay. It'll, it'll be fine. Oh, my God. Gosh, that worked way better than I had anticipated. That is fantastic. Oh, we have got to do this again. Now, the problem is when I reset the car, as you can see, it's not exactly on the tracks. So we're just going to pick it up, move it over just a little bit. Oh, look at that. Oh, my gosh. I cannot believe that worked. Oh, here we go. All right. <laughs> Slightly different angle. The rear wheels giving it the grip that it needs so that it won't slip. And look at this. Look at that giant loop. The loop up and over. Oh, right there. There must be a weird transition because we jump the track every single time. Oh, oh. <laughs> and of course... We're going to slam into the wall. Okay, we've got to try this with a, another vehicle. All right, here we are. The SBR, well, the ESBR. Now, I've got the rear, oh, man, I've got the rear wheels on, you know, with the regular tires. This does not look anywhere near... As promising. Let's see what happens if we turn off the ESC. Is that helping or hurting? I'll be honest, it's a little hard to tell. <laughs> you want to be looking at the airspeed in the lower right corner, not the actual, uh, not the not the speedometer, but the airspeed. Yeah, we're just not. That is not gonna make it. Okay. Huh. Let's. I, I think we can try that again. Let's see. We got everybody lined up. Yeah, everybody looks good. And the tires are riding on top of the rail. Oh, no, no, no. Oh, okay. And they sink down. Oh, well, um, I, I fell off the rail. All right. Here we go. Let's just do it. Come on. See if we can get this bad boy going. Here we go. Oh, wait. Oh, whoa. We've jumped the track. Oh, you know what? Just let this one ride anyway. The rear wheels stuck in the track. The front wheels nowhere near the track. And we are losing speed as we go up the hill. Okay, this is a dud. I tell you what, we did the Moonhawk. Let's jump over. Let's try the Barstow Dragster. There we are. The Barstow Dragster. Look at that. This just looks awesome. Could you imagine if you, I don't know, were, you're, you're situated in the grandstand somewhere and this is the show that is being put on for you today a dragster with its tires on the back and these weird railroad car wheels on the front oh look at that oh Ooh. Ooh, I think we actually left the track just a hair and again we jumped the track. There's a weird transition, but holy cow, that is fantastic. Now, can we stop slow? Come on, come on, come on. Oh, well, we hit the wall at 15, so yeah, it, it happens, man. Uh oh, this is phenomenal. Oh, my goodness. Let's see what this looks like from the driver's seat. Oh my gosh, look at this. This is crazy. We're on railroad tracks in a dragster. About to do oh, a loop-de-loop. -loop. Oh my gosh. That is so weird. My mind is feeling the G-forces and making my body react. That is absolutely intense. Holy smokes. That is absolutely crazy. Oh, you know what, though? I think we can get even crazier. 
What if we grab a JTO bus? Oh, yeah. Ah, here we go. Now, here's the thing about the JTO bus there are no train wheels for the bus because the uh, axle, the wheels are too far apart. However, if you just take the tires off, that's, that's close enough. Oh, come on. Oh, my goodness. Of course, we got the Jato rockets going, giving us the boost we need. Oh, get up and over. Yes. Yes. Sorry. Uh, this is this. <laughs> I generally don't get this crazy and excited during this game, but this. Oh, my gosh. Uh, where else are you going to see a Jato bus going up and and over a loop-de-loop -loop on train tracks. Nowhere. Well, you will now because I did it. I did it first. Or I'm going to claim I did it first. I'm going to claim I recorded it first. It may not get out for three days because of my internet. But I don't care. Ladies and gentlemen, this is fantastic. Look at this. Up. Oh, what? Oh, no, no, no. No, no, no. What What happened? Oh, this is not good. This is not good. <laughs> Somewhere. Oops. Okay. Huh. So what did I do differently? Hey, well, we ended up on, you know, upright on all, well, I was going to say all fours, I guess, technically on all six. Huh. I, I'm not exactly sure what went wrong there. Okay, well, I'll tell you what we're going to do. Let's just, uh. Let's just get with it. I say, come on. Let's do this. I'm going to rev the engine and then start the JTOs, which I think that's what I did the first time. I think I actually had revved the engine, making the wheels spin, and then added the JTO. So that, that may be the secret sauce. Look at this. Look at this. Oh, wait. Oh, maybe not the secret sauce. Wait. Come on. Yes, there it is. Up, over the top, around, through the weird little <laughs> track transition there on the end of that. Oh, I, I got to tell you, man, this is one of the reasons why I absolutely, and I say this a lot, I know, and you can probably, you're ready to quote it right with me. I love this game <laughs> because the stuff you can do with it is absolutely incredible and unbelievable. Now, as for the track itself, we'll do a deeper dive into it. Take a look. It's essentially a grid map V2, but with train tracks everywhere. This is put out by Spencer Johnson, as I mentioned at the beginning of the video. You can check it out. It's only available on his Patreon right now. That is patreon.com slash Spencer Johnson, and you can... Uh, Whoa. join his uh, Patreon and you get access to all kinds of cool maps that this dude is working on. He is like King Supreme when it comes to some of the crazy stuff you can do in BeamNG map making. Oh, man. In the meantime, thank you so much for watching. Got any questions, problems, suggestions, horror stories? Feel free to leave those down in the comment section below. Special thanks to Hero of God, Gamer Gall, Los Wilco, Connie C, and Zachary for supporting the channel through my Patreon, patreon.com slash davidinark, or the channel membership. You can check that out down below. Don't forget, I've got a store now, so you want to check out the merch as well. Once again, thank you so much for watching. I'm David and Ark. Have a great day.